I, have you ever felt that the traditional way of practicing is too boring? Well, that shouldn't be because one, you might fall asleep and two, you just don't want to do it. But it's also very hard to escape the traditional way of practicing. So that's when I had an idea. Ding! So that's why I made this. Near math, calculate, survive. It may seem like an ordinary roguelike game at first, where you, sh where you shoot some bad guys, earn, earn different upgrades. For example, Titan Hole. The, these are all names created by AI, by the way, and it's so creative. It's Titan Hole, Max HP plus 20%, Nanobot Repair, Heal, Equip Star Color. It's like a shotgun, and I love this weapon. Trust. Okay, um, calculate 5 cubed, 125. And the main thing about this website is that you play, but you also learn. And it's very fun. So without knowing, you could calculate, like, you could practice, like, hundreds of questions. So 26 minus 16, 10. And also, you could you could choose which topic you want to learn. Like, arithmetics, algebra, geometry, and um, percentages. You could also import your own questions. So 4 times 8, 32. Oh, no, I'm dying. Shotgun. Very cool. So now I want to equip Splitting Core because I already have the strongest weapon inside the game. Fourth triangle number 10. Yes. Uh, 17 plus 11. 28. Um, minus 18. 4. Highest common factor. Oh, I don't know about this. Um, th uh, 36. Uh, what's 2 times 18? 20, 36, yeah, 36. No, oh, I got it wrong. But that's fine, because you do not lose health if you get a question wrong here. You could even do a dash. You could open quick fire mode. I haven't got a chance to show you, because I already killed so much enemies. You could uh, enhance your move speed. So, um, highest common factor of 12 and 18. Ah, um, do Oh, factor. I thought it was multiple. Oh, okay. Anyways. Three. Oh, no. Actually, it's six. Yippee. Um, 18. Three. Twelve. I hate the 12 time table. You could even go quick fire mode where you fire slightly quicker. Um, and, I'll, and then you earn money by killing these enemies. And then, with the money, you could buy more characters. For example, like the character, so this one, I think it's called a Cypher or something. It has like it has two abilities. One is a dash, one is overclock, which basically makes you faster. The second one, I think, is like a punch barrage or something. Okay, six. Um, minus 22, one. <clears throat> Um, two to the two times two times three times five. No, I got it wrong. But anyways, um, nearest ten, so twenty times fifty, a uh, thousand. Five cube, me five. Um, oh, this is so overpowered. I am so strong. <gasps> And you don't have to stick with these default questions like 12 divided by 4, 3, 48 divided by 4, 12, uh, minus, uh, 49 minus 20, 29, those come a multiple of 12 and 18. Um, so, 6. Well, I got it wrong. I forgot what it is. Um, I actually don't know how to do this. Oh, 39, 109. Yippee! Okay, you do not have to stick with the, um, default. So let me just leave for a second. 
So you also don't have to stick with the default question. You can also add custom questions. Right now, the only way you could add custom questions is by scanning a photo of um, questions, I guess. It could be from like websites like Dr. Frost or whatever. And then it scans it. It adds it in. And if it's like a, a choice question, it'll automatically give you choices. So now if you go back to near math, cipher, okay. And you sh start shooting bad guys. Shoot these quick ones because they're easy to kill. And these big ones as well because they don't really chase you. Okay, that's your way out to freedom. And then star color, which is 50% of 18, 9. 25% of 12, 3, 20% of 35, um, 7, 50% of 60, um, 30. Okay, so to actually like use the questions you just put, it, put in, because the questions are around arithmetic. So you have to change it to arithmetic instead of pretend percentages. So now if you play, you should be able to see your questions. Um just kill um bad guys. Pew 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 pew. Okay, nice. Now we have our own questions. Which of the following numbers does the digit eight stand for eight tens? This one? Yes. Round Four five eight two to the nearest a hundred. Four hundred and uh four thousand and six hundred. Yippee Uh which of the following numbers does eight stand for eight tens? The greatest like this question there's no right answer. So yeah, I think it's a bug, but I would definitely fix it. Or maybe I, I, I just got it wrong. So okay. Four uh four six hundred Okay, now you have it. Oh, boom. Now you have a way better weapon. This is an uh, auto fire. You have a ton of options. Nanobot repair. Basically, repairs myself. Gives me more health. Um, um, nine. Boom. And it doesn't freeze the game for you. So you might have to. Now I could go on overclock mode to make it extra fast. Oh. Oh. Okay, and splitting core. Adds the projectiles. Yippee! Um, it's a pretty rare find, actually. Is this one? Oh, I didn't get it correct, but anyways. 40. 1, 2, 3, 4, 6, 8, um, 12, 24. Nice. Perfecto. Perfecto. Now I have two beams of light rays I could use to to um to kill the enemies. Let me go on overclock mode where I'm just super OP. Another splitting core. I'm gonna be so overpowered. Um greatest. I keep on getting this wrong for some reason. Um 36. Um, 57. Oh, damn. Nice. Um, arc scatter. It's a new weapon. It might not be as good, but I don't care. Okay. I'm already overpowered. I cannot die. I am invincible. Um, four plus two. Times six. six. Times six is twelve. No, actually, it's two times six first, and then plus four. So two times six, twelve plus four, sixteen. Yippee! I got it correct. Here's the following is the greatest. I never get this question right for some reason. Maybe it's a bug. I might fix it. Um, calculate the remind. Oh, this is too hard. Um, I give up. I do not know how. 
Um, I think it's gonna be something like two. Yippee! Well, the following is great. Oh yeah, I think this is a bug. I bet that this is a bug. And why am I so slow? Oh, damn. This is so cool. Arc scatter. It's basically like throwing knives. Oh, I died. So basically, this is it. This is a game that makes learning fun. So thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Bye.